Today Kelly is working with Sadie, a six-year-old quarter horse mare, and uh, Kelly has uh, helped me with my horses here, and uh, she wanted to do some trimming for me, so we're uh, doing things a little bit different than normal. What we're trying to do with uh, the horses is to basically let them stand untied and uh, teach them to be calm. As you can tell right here, Sadie's giving uh, Kelly a little bit of trouble, but Kelly's doing the right thing. She's just kind of hanging in there with the mare. She, she's relaxed her hand. She's letting uh, uh, Sadie relax, and now she's going to move her up to the cradle. We use a cradle on the hind feet. Uh, this really reduces the strain on the back. It also makes the horse feel much more secure than just having it on your legs. Uh, Kelly is, uh, as you can see, she's got the foot in the cradle. It allows her to use both her hands and um, relax while she uh, finishes off the hind foot here. Uh, and you can see she's working on the diagonal so she doesn't uh, cut into the quarters. And uh, she's got a little bit of a rotating uh, rotation on her wrath so uh, gets a nice smooth foot and um, she's doing a really good job now we're bringing the foot forward here onto the hoof stand and taking the flare out of the foot and beveling the edges so that in the event that she did step on herself there isn't that sharp edge that often occurs when you uh, first trim a horse uh, we bevel the edges so that they less likely of them uh, cutting their other feet with that sharp hoof and that hoof is very sharp as you can see Sadie is standing here loose she's got her head down the cats over there playing around the other side of her she's holding um, it all together while Kelly works on her here and is really doing a good job and see how curious Sadie is about well wh what are we doing here what kind of, they're interested in your tools they develop that curiosity uh, here Kelly is starting on a front foot. Uh, she cleaned up the, f the front foot with uh, the hoof knife and uh, what we try and do it, it is uh, cut the sole down to live sole so we can determine uh, how far down we can trim on the hoof. I don't like to trim too far into the live sole. Uh, no, no use making the horse sore to travel. Like to show this horse like this now, where 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 she's uh, allowing you to work on her, you know. Yeah, with nobody holding her. Nobody holding her, and, and she turns around, and looks at you. 